Well, here we are. Day two. <laughs> and I did not do a very good job. This is really hard. Um, Alright, so these are the zombies that I took out of the purple power. And scrubbed on them uh, now for looks like two hours. I've been <laughs> scrubbing away at these. Um, by the way, uh, I've been using this brush here. So this uh, wire brush, um, that's kind of the tool of choice. I, I tried using these regular toothbrushes. They don't really work that well. And by that well, I mean at all. So I've um, been using the wire brush, which works all right. Um, still, you need elbow grease, lots of elbow grease. Scrubbing away two hours. Um, it doesn't actually look, look like I've done much, but uh, these guys are actually, um, here for comparison, let me pull out so you can see those top guys there, these ones, they're not done yet. So in comparison, these guys look, yeah, let me stand up, look a bit better. Um, I'm going to probably put these guys back into the cleaning agent just because I feel like I could do a better job if I keep I keep at it but man the stuff just isn't coming off even with this more powerful stuff and I'm not entirely sure how to go about it um, so actually if, if any of you guys know a better way that won't chew up my hands because that thing that thing's like brushing these models with cat claws my hands are all chewed up um, but yeah, kind of <laughs> a little scratched up. But um, yeah, if if anyone knows a better way to strip paint off of models other than a brush, because because the other thing too is is because this thing is so so wide, like it's frayed out at the sides. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, like it's frayed out at the sides. So getting into like the the legs and stuff is 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 difficult, and I actually have to um, I actually have to rip their arms off to get at their bodies because their their arms are you know show model uh, their their arms are kind of in front of their torsos a little bit, so you can't actually get in there without ripping their arms off. Which uh, and actually here's all their arms and bits and stuff that I've been scrubbing on. Those are even harder because because the size. But, yeah, if anyone knows a better way to do it other than a brush, that would be awesome. I'm not sure if there is one, but definitely be open to it. This is as hard going. Um, what I might actually do is, is leave these guys um, in the fluid for, for a couple of days. I don't know, that might be a bit risky. I've heard Purple Power can degrade the model itself if left in too long. Uh, I'll have to look it up and look into it, see exactly the details on that. But I kind of want to leave these guys in a little bit and, and work on skeletons for the rest of the week. Um, I have the fourth off, so I might actually just spend the day working on the skeletons. I have way more of them um, that need work. Uh, you saw that soup last night. Um, and, uh, <laughs> yeah, it was... Uh, it was kind of a disaster, so I feel like that one's going to be a, a larger task, but but easier. It looks like the paint on those has just kind of fallen off, so it'll, it should be a fairly easy task per bit to, to scrub down. But if there's, if there's a better way to do this for paint that's stubborn, I'd love to hear it uh, from you guys. And also, speaking, speaking of you guys, I have to say, um, I've already just... Um, in the last 24 hours, seeing my channel get get a, a, a bunch of subscriptions and comments and stuff, and, and I have to thank everyone for 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 looking at my video and giving me the comments and and uh, the uh, encouragement. Um, that's that's beyond awesome. I I really appreciate it. Um, I think uh, with with you guys helping me out and just kind of joining hands and doing this together it'll be it'll be awesome
no doubt. So anyway, this is a this is gonna be a short video tonight. Just wanted to show you my progress for the day. Scrub down these guys. Um, they they weren't completely uh, black at the at the beginning of of the night. Um, I think I mentioned it before that I I had already started these. Uh, this guy here actually, let's see, he's actually one of my better ones. Um, this is Brian the zombie. He's the first zombie I I built, and I actually uh, uh, built him and then tried out my airbrush on him before I built any other zombies. So um, he got a name. That's Brian. So yeah, I I'd already started working on these guys, but but I actually made quite a bit of progress, and I think if I put these guys back in for a couple days, they might be a little bit easier, and, and we're actually getting close. I think I have more done now than I than I have left, so that's cool. Well, done is relative. <laughs> They're all kind of crappy, but all right, I will sign off now before I start to ramble. Um, again, I, uh, I really appreciate the comments and, and feedback that I'm already getting. Uh, I'm loving it, and uh, can't wait to can't wait to get on it again tomorrow.